pound for pound sports entertainment hit the like button hit the subscribe button right now if you have not subscribed to the channel ladies and gentlemen go ahead and hit that subscribe button for your boy as well as hit the thumbs up button if you like this video or any other videos on the channel as well as hit that notification button that way when i post it you get it baby with that being said it's your host f merit we're gonna get right to it like we always do now word on the street allegedly that's right allegedly tgb promotions that's right tgb promotions who works hand in hand with pbc premier boxing champions has a november i believe november 2nd one of those days early early november they have an early november date set um and i believe it's las vegas they had that 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 that, that date set for a super big matchup now we know towards the end of the year they try to you know any promotion they try to kind of throw their best out there get everybody you know go to the events and whatever like that um we already got the canelo fight in september you know what I'm saying a lot of people are speculating a lot of people are are trying to hint that javante davis is going to be on that november date and i would everybody's going to want to see javante davis that's right the face of boxing the new face of boxing shall i say javante tank davis they would love to see him back in the ring in november the question is who is it going to be against now we have some conversations going on about shakur stevenson trying to take on uh, uh zapata over at you know golden boy uh shakur stevenson is a free agent he's no longer with top rank uh eddie hearn and the zone and matchroom promotions are probably going to get shakur stevenson so making that fight with uh golden boy and oscar de la hoya and zapata over there i mean they're on the same network on the zone that's that's kind of a, a no-brainer zapata has been talking shakur stevenson has been talking but also there was a lot of discussion about shakur stevenson wanting to fight javante davis now we don't know what javante davis wants to do um he just came off a spectacular knockout win over frank martin he defended his 135 uh title um there are a couple opponents for javante davis i mean obviously whoever tank fights is going to get the the biggest payday of their career so if that's Shakur stevenson hey i think that's a fan friendly as far as namesake that's a big matchup for both fighters um we also have a rio you know jose venezuela who just came off defeating Isaac cruz and taking his 140 a uh, belt title away from him in spectacular fashion he, he outboxed him and, and did a great job so i mean hey that is an option for javante davis but that would be at 140 pounds if javante davis wants to come back up to 140 pounds try to take that title or bring jose venezuela that's right ryo bring him back to 135 we'll see how that goes but like i said that is an option for javante davis Hell, Zapata is an option for Javante Davis. Shakur Stevenson is an option. Option. He's got a couple other options, but we don't know what he's going to do. All I know is the date is locked in. Uh, uh, you know, GTB Promotions, uh, PBC, no early November. If Tank is on that, I would like to see him take. Hell, Lomachenko has Lomachenko changed his mind if he wants to fight or not? Because I, I forgot about him. Honestly, I forgot. I don't know why I forgot about Lomachenko, but allegedly according to his team he wasn't really in the mood to fight i don't know if that was some mind games or if he honestly wasn't in um, honestly just wasn't in the mood to fight last time we seen lomachenko was at the terrence crawford fight him and uh shakur stevenson got into it so i'm just confused you're not in the mood to fight but you're showing up to a boxing match and getting into a shouting match with shakur stevenson and it kind of looked like they were talking crazy but not really talking crazy because there was a lot of smiling and, and a lot of people you know both of them saying some stupid stuff like lomachenko said oh let's go fight outside shut up that sounded stupid you don't want to fight Tank. You're not in the mood to fight Tank for a career-high payday and a chance at a, at a world title at a WBA championship and unify, but you want to fight Shakur Stevenson outside for free. Does that make any type of sense? Anyway, but, um, yeah, like I said, if Javante Davis is on that November uh, date, I would love to see him against anybody. Tank can beat anybody. Shakur can beat anybody. Anybody. I would love to see it. It's time for big matchups, ladies and gentlemen. We will keep you posted on everything that's going on in the sport of boxing. Hit that like button. Hit the subscribe button. And let me know who you would like to see Javante Tank Davis fight next if he actually is going to be headlining that November, that early November card at the end of the year. So hit that like button. Hit the subscribe button. It's your host, F. Merritt. Pound for Pound Sports Entertainment. I'm out.